Good luck, you see what I have the rest of my fidgets? Oh no. It's autistic. <laughs> Check this out. What is this? It's the launcher for the um, stupid fidget spinner things. Oh, what? I think I made a slight mistake though with it. It's a little too short, but we should fire it anyways. Okay. I think you dropped your phone. Oh, my recording platform. All right, you ready to test this out? I think yeah. we should, yeah, we'll test it and then I'll probably make modifications. Are you ready? I think it went through both sides. Look, oh, that's a little more, that's better than I thought. What do you think, Greg? Yep. I like the EOTech. It is done! Actually, it's not done yet. I still gotta decorate it. We have to finish drawing. We should test it out. Oh, wait. I didn't think the safety catch out. Oops. Ah, uh, I forgot to pull the safety out. Oh my god, this is killing me.
go. Open your hand. What is that? <laughs> it's pretty freaking sharp. I made it like this. Boop. Okay, um, since yesterday, I fixed it. It's slightly better. The front end was breaking off, so I changed that. One of the thingies were broken, so it's now refixed. And now we have this deadly steel machete blade. I think I'm kind of done with the spinning mud tosh. Let's just actually just run around and break stuff with it. Spin up the steel fidget spinner thing or jigger. Oh no, my GoPro! It totally got complainer painterated. For all you're wondering about doing stupid experiments at home and you get paint everywhere, if the paint's still relatively new, some denatured alcohol will clean off your GoPros. In. <laughs> oh, that's awesome! It did more damage than I expected it to do to this can. It didn't come out the other side, so it still kind of sucks. I'm not sure if this is legitimately lethal or not, but it's it's definitely not something you want to be shot with. Yeah, I think I um, actually read about that on the back of the can. Yeah, don't try that at home. We're technically at home, but okay. Good thing I didn't catch on fire. I come from. It's on fire, Ricky Bobby. There's your denatured alcohol about to go. Oh, oh, I need this. I don't want to burn that. Oh, I, I will tilt. It's on fire. Yeah, this is stupid. Why would we do that again? You said try it at home. Oh, that poor fidget spinners. Hey, look, your cancer, it's going away. Ah, it's still on fire. Oh, that was hot. <laughs> okay, we're done. Well, I think I'm kind of actually done now. I might have created ways to destroy things with this launcher thing. Well, I'm actually fairly pleased with the way it turned out. For having to never really bolt a giant slingshot catapult thing majigger, this thing worked all right. Even though it is, it could use some improvements. Mainly, I should have made it shoot much heavier steel fidget spinners because those little plastic ones kind of suck. They're just not very heavy. So these don't really tend to go through things. They just kind of like bounce off of most items and fly around. I kind of wanted to go with the sheet metal, but hey, free idea for anyone else who's got a channel who wants to do something crazy and stupid. Build a giant slingshot thing and shoot steel fidget spinners and break some bigger stuff. You should also totally check out the uh, slingshot channel. There's this guy named Jorg Sparv, something like that. He's been on YouTube for a very long time. And I remember watching him before I even made this channel. He actually makes like slingshots, like really, really cool ones. And he actually did a fidget spinner one. But um, mine was slightly different because mine put a spin on him, even though his was more powerful. But definitely check that out. Give him some support and... Um, I think that's it. See you in the next video.